My name is Michelle Alvin. I'd like to express my disinterest in the actions of my friends, my fellow Eckerd students, people around me, more specifically my roommate who I have to deal with every day. I want people to know that drug abuse is happening and it's not necessarily their fault or my roommate's fault. I think it's the drug company's fault. Just see for yourself what I have to deal with on a daily basis. Come eat some chemicals with me. Come eat some chemicals. Come eat some chemicals with me. <sighs> Such a bad day. I guess I'm tired. Depressed? Might as well be. This one will be dedicated to my mom. See everyone? That's my roommate every day. Every day she does that. It's because she has such easy access to drugs, she can do it. That was real footage of my roommate, but to better show how students obtain their drugs so easily from drug companies, I'd like to show a reenactment with dramatizations of just how it happens. Feel overwhelmed by sadness. You're tired, hopeless, and anxious. You're no longer interested in the things you once loved. Simply put, you just don't feel like yourself. What you're feeling are the symptoms of depression, a serious medical condition afflicting over 30 million Americans. Though there is no definitive cause, depression may be related to an imbalance of natural chemicals in the brain. Prescription Epiphanix works to balance these chemicals. Epiphanix is not for everyone. blood pressure, vaginal dryness. I didn't understand any of the warnings, but I want to take that. This demonstrates a perfect example of how confusing commercials can be. The appeal is high and the warning is too fast. Now that the interest in a certain product is there, let's just see how our friend obtains the drugs. They'll fuck you, then they'll fuck themselves. They raise a flag that Jesus said. Hello, I'm Dr. Alvin. How can I help you today? Hi, yes. Um, I'm depressed, unhappy, anxious. I just I just need Epiphanex. Epiphanex? Yeah. Oh great. I'm so happy to write you that prescription. Okay. Uh Epiphanex, one order. Here you go, ma'am. Thank you so much. Okay. It's pretty apparent that that doctor was given incentives to advertise that particular drug. Not only was he basically bribed to advertise that drug, but it was Epiphanex company itself that educated the doctor on what symptoms should be treated with a certain drug. Ooh. Damn, this Epiphanex is good. But I only have half one left. I wonder how I can get more. She went through those drugs pretty fast. Probably she's misusing them, taking them at an inappropriate dosage. And she wants some more now. It's pretty easy to get. Let's see how she does it. In general, getting drugs is really easily, and you can fake a prescription online, or you can refill your dose at an interval that's too quickly. Drug companies need to know this. <laughs> drugs! Drugs! I love drugs! Plain and simple, drug companies are making it easy for people to abuse drugs by offering online pharmacies or supporting advertising or inappropriate doctor education. This needs to change because they and they need to know about it.